everybody, I'm super excited today because everybody's been asking me to do a favorites video. A favorites video. So I'm gonna do mine, but with a little twist. We are gonna give them candy awards. They're gonna go to my most favorite new addiction, must love products. And I'll do them by categories. We'll do makeup products, then we'll do cheap ones, my more professional ones. We'll do some of the style products, hair products. Some random clothing, fashion products, and um, accessories. So let's get started with the candy awards for fall. fall. Or autumn. I've used these in other videos and I think they're fabulous. I think everybody should have them. We should totally start a trend. And again, no lenses, because they reflect. Oh, okay, no. First up for favorite makeup product. We're going to start with the cheapo things and we'll move up to the higher end things. Cheap drugstore makeup product is going to be for foundations. It would be L'Oreal True Match Foundation. I've used it for years, it's super cheap, and I think it's marvelous. So that's my number one drugstore brand. Next up for favorite drugstore mascara is the L'Oreal Double Extend Tubes. I love this stuff. I am addicted to it. You put the white side on first and you coat it underneath and then that builds up this big layer and then you put the black on top and then it won't smudge off, smear off, flake off anything. You just take hot washcloth like when you're in the shower put a hot washcloth on your eyes, hold it there for a few seconds, pull it down and all the little tubes come entirely off onto your little washcloth. It is awesome and I love this stuff. One more cheap drugstore thing that I am really loving right now is this silver metallic glittery nail polish. Do you see this? I love it. It's cheap. It's Sally Hansen Hard as Nails in Celeb City. Ooh, fancy. So that's all I have for cheap drugstore brands. Now moving on to category number two. Number two. My favorite foundation, the Laura Mercier Moisturizing Foundation. I love this stuff. I have loved this for many, many years. Many, many years. I won't even say how long because it'll make me feel really old, but I love this. It looks beautiful on everybody. Mine is in Sunny Beige. Next, I do a two-part combo. This is Makeup Forever High Def. This is a little dark. I use light for all over and dark for contouring and shading. Makeup Forever, Laura Mercier, my big winners. Big winners. Next, my winner for most amazing concealer that makes anybody look phenomenally perfect. They're, your skin will never look as perfect as with this stuff. And I am so addicted to this right now. I can't believe that no one has discovered this sooner. I love this. It is Cover Effects. This is their um, cream foundation. It is beautiful. It comes like this. I have never seen anything cover like this. And it's not developed by a skincare company. It's by a lady that had to come up with medical grade um, things to cover people that had skin discolorations or disorders. Um, so this will cover tattoos, any rosacea, freckles, anything. It's amazing coverage. Will cover under eye, eye circles like nobody's business. The, I am so addicted to this. And as a makeup artist, this is something I would use on set, on celebrities. This is amazing, amazing, amazing. You can get it at Sephora. I'm not sure where else. You can get it at namies.com. Oh, I will put a link down below to my blog. Go to my blog and I will take you to all the places where you can find all the things in here. I'll find all the links for you guys in case you want to buy them. So this, I love, 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 love this so much. Okay, so that's all for expensive foundations. My favorite lip colors. And my favorite lip colors now have been this hot pink color that I did a video on. But I don't think anybody watched it because they keep sending me what colors was I wearing. And if they watched the video, they would know. So if you didn't watch the video, I used um, this Fuchsia Color Aqualip 16C from Makeup Forever. Then I go over the edges with Cherry Red from MAC. I love this. It's a beautiful combo. Then on total opposite side of the color spectrum is the nude color, which I have on now, which I'm really loving. My winners for the other favorite nude, more nude color lip liner for fall would be Naked Lip Liner from Urban Decay with Plum from MAC over it. Do I always use two lip liners? Yeah, pretty much always. One of the most important things you learn in art school or makeup school, use more than one color to get a fabulous one color look. Now my winners for skincare items. People ask, what do you clean your face with, Candy? 
I use Burt's Bees Citrus Facial Scrub. I am almost out. You can see just how much I use this stuff. I just scrub it around to wash all the makeup and dirt off my face. I've been using it for years. Next, we're moving on to scented body fragrance type things. This is Eye Smell Soap from Ivy Eye Scents in Birthday Cake. Not only is it in cute packaging that I love, and it's handmade from a girl that started this company, and I totally support Go Women Business Power on your own from LA. She hand makes the soap, hand wraps the soap, and I will open this up for you because this smells. I wish there was a way I could transfer smell through here because it smells so delicious. You want to eat it. Mm. Oh my gosh, do you see that? Oh, I wish you could smell it. It smells so good. My favorite one is she has a body butter in the birthday cake, but I loved it so much. I've already used it up, so I don't have any more. But this is amazing. Amazing. Smells so good. I love things that smell good and yummy like cake and vanilla. So this is, oh my gosh, it's like a treat when you take a shower and you smell this. Next, my candy award for most fabulous fragrance in the whole world that I've been wearing for years and I just can't seem to wear any other perfume besides this. Dun, da, da, da. Vanilla Extreme. <laughs> Come to our Sud Pacifique. I probably said that totally wrong. Um, but this is Vanilla Extreme. I wear this all the time. I've been wearing it for years. And I can't wear anything else. I love how this smells. It's, you smell like cake or icing or vanilla. It, nothing, no other vanilla has smelled as amazing as this. I love this. Used to get it at Sephora. I don't know, some people say they get it at Urban Outfitters. They get it at Sephora, Ulta, I don't know. Google it. You will love it. On to the style awards. So people asked about my accessories. Um, next up is my supreme necklace, which again, this is really not a fall favorite, so I don't know if this counts because I wear it every day. But um, I have a little surprise something for you. You can have your very own supreme necklace too. One of my friends, Missy, actually had some of these made, and I'll put a link if you want to order some. I don't know if she has any left, but um, I think they're like $34. They're very fancy, fancy chain. You can adjust them. Like mine, some because this is from a Cutlass Supreme, so they're hard to find the car thing. So she just had these made. If you want them, again, go to my blog, and the link will be in there. How you can find those out and see if she has any left. Na 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 na. These are my favorite rings. This yellow ring my sister got for me a while ago as a present, so it has sentimental value. Um, she got it at Nordstrom's at their brass plum department. Many other flower rings, none as comfortable and marvelous as this one. Next up is my new favorite bow ring. I don't know because I googled to see where to get this and I love it so much. I even bought it in two other colors. But I just love the turquoise so I just keep wearing it. It was super cheap. I got them at a vintage shop um, when I was in London doing my glam art there and I tried to find more and I don't know where you can get them. So if anybody knows, post below because I love them. Next is my feather ring, which I always wear. I don't know if it's a new addiction because I wear it all the time. And I always wear two different earrings pretty much. So this, I don't know, I probably got this at like Forever 21 or something. That's where I get most of my jewelry. I got a little black bow ring from Forever 21. Um, this is from my friend Cardi. You can go to my blog and I'll put a link. She hand makes them so each one is one of a kind. You can't get any duplicates. Hers are beautiful and they're really authentic and she has a careful way that they get the feathers from birds. The feathers have fallen out. They're not pulling them out of birds. So I've been really wearing flannel things with white wife beaters underneath. And then I only button like the top few. I kind of like it like that. Um, you could just even button the top and then leave it open with your wife beater. White Hanes, Hanes tank top underneath. And then just button it kind of like this. If you want to start a trend with me, you can wear it too. I pretty much live in these same pairs of shoes every day. These are my Mies Moose boots. Um, these are fabulous. I love them. They're kind of like little old Victorian schoolgirl, but kind of punky. And they're super comfortable. I put a pair of Dr. Scholl's gel things inside because I'll want to be gelling. And it makes them like slippers. I love these. They're so comfortable. And you got a little tiny hidden heel so you feel tall. Rubber on the bottom so you won't slip and fall. 
I love these. Next winner for favorite shoe are my Minnetonka moccasins. I love these. See the fringy? I love them. They're comfortable. They're like slippers. Next up for third place winner is my Doc Martens. They are fabulous because they're kind of like beat up looking. They came that way and they have satin lace. And then the cool part is you fold this down like so. You can even buckle it down on the back so it stays and you have these flannel little flippy inserts and then you have a cute little folded down shoe like that. I love them. Winner for hat category. I'm a huge hat wearer. These are some of my favorite hats. This hat I got in a gift shop. I like it because it's green and very cute. My hair is going to look very ugly each time I remove a hat. This I got at the Camden Market. I love this hat. It was super cheap. I love that it's tartan, aka plaid. This is another one of my favorites, this checkered one. I love it. I love crazy patterns and cover color. This is my new addition to Hat World. Probably really gonna mess up my hair now. I love it and think it's adorable. That's it for Accessory World. Let me tell you first, it's gonna go to this teasing comb. It's called Teasing You by Monroe, and this gets your hair so teased. I even travel with this in my purse now. I keep this in my purse. I know that sounds weird. And then um, my favorite hairspray, because it smells so good, I want to eat my hair afterwards almost, is this Sebastian Reshaper. Now this says it's a professional product, so I don't know if you will have a hard time getting the Sebastian Reshaper product or not, but since I'm technically a professional hairstylist holding a cosmetology license, <laughs> aren't I fancy? Um, my drugstore brand hair product winner would be L'Oreal El Net Satin. It's amazing, you can brush it out, and it's probably the oldest hairspray in the world. Look at the packaging, it still looks so 70s and chic. It's so fabulous, it's golden. Okay, next favorite hair product addiction is my GHD flat iron, because this is hard to say that it's just for fall, because I love this thing all the year round. Not only can I straighten my hair, I can curl it. I don't even use a curling iron anymore. I just keep this baby with me everywhere I go. Not in my purse, but when I travel, I wrap it up in some clothes and I throw it in my suitcase. Because this is an investment. You could buy cheapy, junky ones at the store, and I wish I could pick a drugstore brand winner, but there aren't any, because they will pull your hair, pinch your hair, they, this will get your hair pin, paper, straight. I love mine. Um, I'm not really sure how much they are now. I got mine at beautychoice.com. Um, again, you can go to links, so I'll show you guys where to get this. Um, and plus, I'm going to put coupons. If there's coupons or discounts, or I'll find the cheapest price. Go there too. This is amazing. You will love it. I got my sister addicted to this. My mom. Everybody has one of these now and they love it. My mom has super curly hair and she can get it super straight. And if my mother can do it, you can do it too. Um, you will just love this. It is like the best. It's like giving yourself a hair gift. Even if you're worried it's expensive, it's worth it because you will keep it for years and years and years and it will give you a good hair day every day. Winner for coolest phone cover belongs to my phone. It's got Hello Kitty, crystal things, feathers, and jewels. Uh, my friend Karan made this for me, and this is beautiful. I love it. She had one, and I was like, oh my gosh, I love your phone cover. Like, you don't even really need to hold it. Like It's got like a shoulder pad. Like, what? Oh, hello, yeah, it's Karen. And in case you want to know, we made this video at 2.56 p.m., says my phone. You want to see my favorite towel, my favorite toothbrush, my favorite toothpaste, my favorite tooth. I don't have a favorite tooth. <laughs> and that would be weird. Hello. Oh. We will see you in the next video. Remember, comment below. Go to my blog for links. And then comment below if you guys like this video, you want to see more, other favorite things you'd like to see. And um, we'll see you in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.